All right, folks, it's early the next morning. I am crazy, but I'm going back down to the Pine Barrens. It's gonna be really hot today, at least later in the day. Um, so it should make for good cruising later. I'm getting up early to try to flip for milks, uh, hoping that there's some still up from yesterday. Um, it's shot in the dark, but we're gonna go for it. Right now, I'm waiting for a friend of mine. Uh, he's being very, very slow. It's early, but we have milk snakes to catch, so uh, chop, chop, let's get to it. Bye. Yeah, you're bad. Uh, How about snacks? All right, hustle, hustle, let's go. This guy. All right, so first stop of the day, we're sifting through some junk. We already got a little snake racer up under some, some stuff and he's still cold that's a really good sign I was worrying that it was getting too warm but not the coastal we're after but definitely a good sign nice little guy I'm gonna let him go in the bushes and we're gonna keep going through this sweet dude dude Oh, 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 holy That's gotta be a different one. Oh my God. Holy A freaking amazing milk from a rare county in New Jersey. I don't even know if the yellow will come out on camera, but it's like yellow between these bands. It's got this beautiful collar. Just stunning, stunning snake. Holy smokes. That is just an amazing animal. I'm thrilled to have found this. This is phenomenal. Literally doesn't look like it's from New Jersey. So nice. I just do not know if the colors are gonna come out on this, but even the stomach is yellow. I mean, I doubt that's coming out. But holy smokes, look at this thing. It's just stunning. Look at that collar. Oh my God. Such a yellow, yellow snake. I can't even say it enough like this I promise you this thing is like golden yellow on the stomach and in between the bands in person um, We've taken our photos of this guy. It was a good poser for at least a little bit and uh, Now we're gonna let it go Holy smokes though What a stunning animal It's Phenomenal Wow Letting this guy go back in his shingle pile. So freaking cool. I'm like shaking from that. That was such a good... You don't understand, they're incredibly hard to find down here. Like, I went years without finding them down here. And only in the last year I've kind of like learned how. or the context of where we are. Good sign. Mouse City, oh, a dead mouse. Oh, no, he's alive. Yeah, it's nice. Nice. Little baby. Awful. Look at all these mice. Oh, Matt, you want to scoop that guy? It's a good sign that snakes are still in piles. Matt calls it a brown snake. I call it milk snake food. Look at that guy. Neat little guy. Let's check out his belly. We saw a lot of these yesterday. Um, 
Beautiful stomach. Oh yeah. Oops. Yeah, look at that. Real pretty. Nice little snakes. This might be a gravid individual, meaning that it's got little babies inside it. So uh, it's probably trying to heat up in here, but uh, we're gonna let it go in a sec after we finish going through this pile and keep moving. And we'll get the three ticks off those pants. Oh Jesus. One. Oh my God, another one. Two, Ooh. three, Ooh. and there's one down here somewhere right there. Jesus Christ. It's four. Yeah, they're 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 bopping this year. I got one. There yeah. You go. oh. Holy smokes. We're good. Like this. See this block here? Looks so good to me. Oh, that looks good. There's holes under some of these. Try to get that up. Oh yeah, it came up. Nope. Nope. Look at this. A little dappled light. Oh. oh. I can totally see one being here. Matt's still flipping through this junk here, but next snake of the day, um, we did not get a racer crossing the road on film, because they're fast, but, oh, there's a little brown skink under there. See him? Mm-hmm. Right there. Um, anyway, another little red-bellied snake. Um, check out the belly on this guy. Yeah, I like these guys. They're neat. I'm used to seeing them up in the Poconos, so it's always kind of cool to see them down south like this. They're just cute little snakes. Pretty cool. That's what, our second of the day? Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, found a bunch of these yesterday. So we'll put them back in his stuff and uh, keep looking. I don't know what we've just walked into, but brother, may I help you? What are you doing here? He's defensive. He's holding his ground. Are you rabid? Sir? Sir? Hello? Hey. What you say to me? Ooh. Huh. Do you know what to make of this? Not at all. All right, as you were. Uh-oh, he wants to scrap, he's following us. All right, sorry. Sorry, good sir, we're gonna have to keep moving. Nothing exceptionally exciting, but here's some cover I laid over the winter. This guy's gonna be, are you zooming in on that? Yeah. He can zoom out, he might stay long enough. So he's been watching you, for some reason to him, I'm not that frightening because I guess I'm staying still, but you see how he's periscoping like that? Uh -huh. It's pretty cool. I'm sure he's going to take off sooner or later. Should I try to pick him up? He might just kind of hold his ground. Oh, look at that. Yeah, look at that. Whoa! See, that's our coastal leader. Farewell. All right, so uh, it got quite hot out, Ooh, which we expected. Um, so we're just kind of waiting out the heat of the day and uh, seeing what we can turn up just by slowly cruising around on the roads, see if we get lucky. Um, the timber I found recently, that was crossing and less intense heat, but at the same time of day, kind of late afternoon. So, oh, oh, no, it's a stick, never mind. Um, but, uh, yeah, I think we're just gonna take some time to cool off and uh, get some dinner for later, and then when it 
when it starts to cool down a little bit or the sun starts to get a little lower in the sky, that's when we're going to do some some more intentional road cruising. So uh, I'll check in with you guys then, unless we find something sooner. Oh no. All right, first snake of the evening, and it is this little water snake, our first water snake of the day. Let's see this guy. He does look terrified. Snake. It's the belly. Not bad. All right, cool. I'm going to move this guy off the road and uh, the direction he was going. And uh, gonna remove the tick from my arm. All right, next snake of the night is another water snake. Uh, we just cruised. It's nice and flat. We're just gonna give him a little. Hey, hey, come on, man. Come on. Let's go over here. Hey, come on, come off the road. Off the road. Off the road. Off the road. Come on. All right, let's go, buddy. There you go. He's all balled up. Look at that guy. Hey, stay off the road. All right, we're gonna keep cruising. Nice sunset. All right, well, uh, it was a long, long day. And uh, last we videotaped, we were road cruising. We only road cruised water snakes tonight for whatever reason. Um, we had a DOR flipped on its stomach and it had an orange stomach and I drove by and thought it was a corn. It was not. Um, and then weirdly enough, we went a while without cruising any snakes and then there's a big snake in the road on the way home. Um, no idea what it was. I swerved. We were going fast because we were, you know, not cruising anymore. We were going home and we were leaving the, uh, Pine Barrens. And I swerved in the car behind me. We assumed hit it but I turned around and went back and couldn't see it, so hopefully it got out of the way. I don't know what it was, but probably a water snake or a rat snake or something like that. Um, but anyway, uh, thanks for watching today. Uh, we got that cool coastal earlier, which was definitely a highlight. Um, and first coastal of the year for me, and what a good one to start with. So, anyway, thanks for watching. We will catch you guys on the next one, and uh, subscribe if you'd like to. See you around.